Hey Moglets! Today we are finishing up our Electroculus collection, also discussing some of the ones I had the hardest time with. With Inazuma, there are a lot of places with tons of layers, like here in Tartarasuna, like just in this little area here, there's like, I don't know how many floors, there's a ton of floors. And a lot of these here are quite hard to find because there's like little crevices and everything like that. And we're going to go over those in a little bit. I want to try and finish up. Um, I think we have like 15 left or something. And then we'll go over the ones which I found to be the hardest. Most of the ones we have left to find are here on the main island. But there are some here as well. I think there's one right around here where you need like some keys. We're going to go over that as well. I'm missing one key. I'm probably just going to look that up, honestly, because it's just in some random treasure box. And then and then I'll tell you where to get all three of them also. But I think firstly, we have a couple over here on this island, which I haven't gotten yet. I'm pretty sure I need to find the third little electro ball guy to activate this, but I could not seem to find it anywhere. I know there's a puzzle here, which apparently I don't understand because I had them all lined up already, but that didn't do anything. Okay, now it worked. Okay, so there must be some kind of bug every now and then. Um, but now it looks like it's right. I've never seen that before. Maybe it literally needs to be like pixel perfect for it to count. I am not sure. Okay, there there we go. Oh, and there's the third one. Okay, yeah. Because with the other two, you also need to uh, finish some puzzles. All right, so we should be able to get that one pretty easily now. Let's go on up and collect that one. The next one is just over here randomly. Is that it over there in the water? <laughs> okay. What what stops me just from swimming to it? Nothing. Nothing stops me from swimming to it. Okay, uh, that was probably one of the easiest ones, actually. A lot of the ones I'm missing are just, like, in the ocean, because most of the time I'm just going through the game and trying to find them when I see the, uh, you know, little thing pop up on the map. Yeah, the next one over here is out in this purple soup. Okay, yeah, I see it up there. Let's just climb up here and grab this real quick. Oh, jeez. I do gotta say, that was one of the more annoying common chests we have earned. Yeah, this next one is pretty easy, too. I guess you have to solve a puzzle here first, though. The next two are over on this island and this island. There was one here as well, but we have that already. Yeah, I see it up there. Okay, you obviously can't get this one until you do the Sacred Soccer quest, because you'll need the Memento Lens. I guess that spawned a thing somewhere? What the heck? Okay, you need to use it on this one too, I guess. There it is. Now we can just go in. Another little dude here. And okay, now we should be able to go up and grab it. There we go. Next one is over here. I'm not actually seeing it anywhere. It's not even popping up on the map. Potentially, we did get this one already and just forgot to mark it. Oh, well, we did find a chest down here. Yeah, either there's an error with the interactive map I'm using, or I got it already and just forgot to mark it. If it's evident we're missing one, then we'll come back to it. There is another one around here. I believe I remember this one. You have to come down here. Yeah, okay, I remember now. There is a uh, barrier here. This could actually be a pretty hard one to find, because you're going to be looking maybe at the surface level a lot. Uh, I forgot exactly where it was, but there should be a wall around here. Yes. And you need a level 17 tree. Yep, and a treasure box. So let's just go ahead and grab this Electrogranum. And there we go. Just gotta climb a bit to reach this, I guess. See if we can glide and grab it, yeah. Yeah, and then the one over here as well. I was looking for this forever. Uh, yep, there it is. Well, the barrier is right here, sort of on the right side. I'm having the most trouble actually finding a tree. Like, over here on this floating rock is like the closest one I can find. I doubt there's enough time though. Yeah, gone already. Do I keep it if I warp? That's the question. Oh, I do. Come on. Oh, dude. Ugh. I think it's possible. This definitely goes in there as one of the harder ones. <laughs> Unless I'm missing an obvious tree somewhere. Let's try this again. I have a feeling this is not exactly what you're supposed to do, but if it works, it's not stupid, I guess. No, dude, come on. <laughs> Wait a minute, I just had big brain, hold on. Never mind, there's literally one floating right here, I just didn't see it. Oh my god, well, my big brain idea, not that it matters anymore, was just to use a portable teleporter, because they stick with you while teleporting. But yeah, there's just a rock there, alright. Oh, and we are high enough level. I thought that was like an advanced one. Haven't seen any of those yet. Maybe, maybe they're only in 2.1 or something. It's a pretty easy to miss rock, okay? I'm definitely counting this as one of the hardest ones. I was looking for this forever, and I did come across the barrier a few times, but I didn't really think about it. 
Uh, there are also some dudes over here we're gonna use the mementolins on. Maybe we get something. Sounds like a chest. Ooh, a luxurious chest. But yeah, what we actually came here for, the Electroculus. Man, that was a pain. Okay, not really sure how I missed this one, but it's, uh, there's some sort of gate under here, though. All right, here's one of the, like, last two or three I have left to collect. It's not very easy to miss, honestly. I guess you just have to pass through this area and you'll see it pop up. Probably this is the more official way to grab it, yeah. Yeah, it's kind of bizarre. We're gonna check if it's somehow underground. Ah, uh, yeah, here we go. Bro, how is this going to be one of my <laughs> last ones? <laughs> That's just embarrassing. But anyway, there we go. And I think here is the second to last one now. Again, not very hard to find. Maybe a little bit hard to get though. Be I hate climbing trees. Ugh. Wait, wait, wait. Go. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, for this last Electroculus, there are going to be three treasure boxes in this area. So like I said, for this one, I am missing one key. So we're gonna go to all three locations again. For the first key, you wanna warp over here, come down here and you'll see an Electrogranum. Pick that up, go towards this uh, bubble here. And if you keep going down, there'll be this little hidden uh, place with the treasure box and this is in fact the one I was missing. So there's the uh, third one, but we're gonna go over the other two locations as well, of course. I believe these will be a little bit easier to find, so let's go ahead and warp here. Make your way over to the ledge and simply jump off. And pretty much directly below you should be a chest here next to this uh, broken bridge. I have already picked it up. And finally the last one is up at the top of this uh, little dead village, whatever the hell it is. And uh, it should be actually right over there on the roof. Right around here. Of course, again, I've picked it up. And then once you have all three keys, you can go ahead and warp back here again. Again, coming to around the same place as the third key, just dropping down a little bit prematurely. And all the way at the bottom, here's the gate where you need the three keys. Just go ahead and use them, and there you go. And our final Electroculus is right up here. So a couple of the other ones I had a lot of trouble with. One, of course, I made a video on a couple days ago. There's this domain you need to use a cannon to blast a hole in the mountain to go inside. I've also heard you can use a small character like Diona or Klee to climb through a small hole. I have, I can't try that anymore. I thought about it, but I figured, no, that's way too small. But apparently that works. And of course, in there is one of the Electroculus. And then we have this other one in the same area as the one we just did with the three keys. We're teleporting back to that waypoint. We're just going on the other side of the mountain this time. And we're dropping down to the river area. Again, this is a place with a ton of layers. Here you will see a path going inward. And I think what makes this uh, one hard to find is that it doesn't really, unless you specifically look up, there is like no indication that there is somewhere else to go and you have to look up and to your right. So unless you're really, really, really looking for it, uh, it would be very easy to miss. Uh, and up here is where the Electroculus is. And actually, this other one in the same area as well, there is a small path that is, again, pretty easy to miss. Uh, you just drop down here to uh, the village area, and there will be some steps up there. It can just be kind of frustrating, honestly, when there are so many layers and there are so many layers in this area. Also, actually getting it is a little bit of a challenge. I did make it a point not to use, you know, Vinti or Zhongli because not everyone has those characters. <laughs> Uh, we just barely got it there, so it's a bit annoying as well. But yeah, one final thing to do now is go to the Statue of the Seven. We are probably going to be missing two. I've already heard some people complain that they are missing two once they are done. Uh, so yes, there we go. We're at 20 out of 22. So I'm going to assume that is actually done until 2.1. Someone can correct me in the comments if I'm wrong, but I think for the others, we're going to have to wait till the next update. Well, I guess let's see if we can get our tree any higher. Not that it really matters. Yeah, we can get it up to 18. I haven't really been doing that much chest farming yet. Basically just picking up the ones I come across. But yeah, I suppose that'll pretty much do it for today's video. Make sure to tell me what you think in the comments down below. Dropping a like if you did happen to enjoy is always greatly appreciated as well. Thanks. As always for watching, and until next time.